Hey guys, welcome back to Javon Rule 16. I am your host, Javon, and today we're back with a brand new benchmark. It's The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim Anniversary Edition for the PC. Today we'll be running this on our Intel Core i3-7100U with the Intel HD 620 integrated graphics. We're running at 720p on the lowest preset. I can never show you the settings because obviously that it has its own launcher with settings which I don't have time to, to show you all as well in video. So I'm just saying it's running at 720p on the lowest. It's crazy how this game still manages to push systems, man. I am shocked that this is running like this. I, I never understand that, but hey, it runs. I can't believe it's not butter. I feel like it's doing better than the Intel HD 4600 by a milestone. At least we are getting about 30 FPS on average. What is that thing? Could the legends be true? I don't know. I wonder who, who dies coming up here. Oh, that's some random guy. I've always wondered that. Oh crap! Dude, I can't take that frame rate. Come on, guy. Look, you destroyed my frames. So unlike the other one, I can tell you right now, this is a this is a, a much smoother experience. Um, it runs fine. Everything seems to be going well. I can move around quite freely. Yeah, it is a much better experience on here. I can see you doing this, being able to run this without any issue. Especially considering there's a lot going on right. There is a lot going on right now on screen. Obviously, a lot of fire effects, a lot of fire. And it's still managing to keep up with it. So it's definitely working quite well right at this moment in time. I see no issue with the game. What if I don't want to stay close to the wall? You ever thought about that? Oh snap, I'm staying close to the wall. Quickly, follow me. Yeah, it's running fine. Like I said, this has a config file, so obviously with a config file, and it is one of those games, we could definitely lower the resolution down to make it somewhat more playable, far more playable actually, obviously. Skyrim is meant to be run on low end, but running it vanilla, 720p on the lowest preset, you can stay over 30 FPS, which isn't bad. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget, please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and stick around for more epic content. As you know, the whole point of my video is to show you guys that how games run on certain hardware, especially integrated graphics, is literally the whole point of my channel. <laughs> I've tested it on everything. I don't even know if I'm, I'm not sure if I'll do it on the potato PC. I don't think I will this time. I think I'll leave it on the Intel HD because the Intel HD 4600 was a struggle. Was that really a Bring us of the end times. Boy. We should keep moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. We got in here and the frame rate went up, man. There you go. Take a look around. There should be plenty of gear to choose from. Love it. I'm going to see if I can find something for these bones. Frame rate just said frame rate be that armor on. Yeah, that sword at you swing. Frame rate be damned. Frame rate doing great all of a sudden. Apparel, he told me get the armor on. And I did. That's what I did. I, I put it on. Did you not see me put on the armor? Let's keep moving. That thing is still out there. Let's go. You you gonna go or you 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 really wanna go? Yes, yeah, so like I said, Skyrim runs fine on the Intel H six twenty. Now, like I said, also it was a little very hectic just now, and it was still managing to get the job done. So I imagine it can actually pull it off quite fine. This would be still enjoyable if you frame cap it to 30 FPS, it'd be less stressful. I'm about to go attack everybody before they can even move. Um, wait. So you now want to move? What happened? I was just attacking you guys. Did you not? Did you? Did you wait? Why would you wait? Oh snap! See, so I distracted you. while the guy hit you? With Oh wow! I didn't even know they were the execution kills in this game. Crazy! I didn't even know that was a thing. Listen, I've never played Skyrim before. I'm not a Skyrim fan, but hey, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. 
Damn. But I ain't going that way. Again. Hi. What's good? What's good? What's Gucci? I'm pretty sure this is not how you're just supposed to play swinging like this, but who cares, right? Why can't they take so much damage? Why can you take so much damage? And I'm gonna take all I'm gonna take all your stuff. Is that good by there talking? What do you mean come this way? Technically speaking, at this moment, you're the one following me. Because you ain't keeping up. Oh. Damn. Brutal. Four times I've played this. Exact same area. And I've only now gotten these, uh, these, these, cinema, these execution kills. It's crazy. <laughs> You learn something new every day. Don't you even know what's going on? A dragon is attacking Helgen. A dragon. Please, don't make up nonsense. Do you really think this random guy just oh, come up to you and say a dragon's attacking? Like, who, who does that? What noise is coming from over there. Come with us. We need to get out of here. You have no authority over me, boy. Didn't you hear me? I said the keep is under attack. But anyway, once again, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to leave a like, a comment, share, subscribe, and stick around for more epic content. Smash that like button if you enjoy this type of content where I show you how to get games running on lower end hardware and how they run normally. Now, excuse me, I have to go to GTA Definitive Trilogy. See if you can get it open with some picks. We'll need everything we can get. So that we can really get some. Bada boom, bada bing. I'll see you guys next time.